A Wyoming high school student is speaking out tonight after she saw some students from Jenison High School racially taunt a member of her school's basketball team. Our digital host, Phil Ponarski, is following this story for us tonight. Phil, we know the superintendents have responded to what they're calling an act of racism, but you heard from a student who was at the game when it happened. What did she say? Donovan Lillian Henry was outraged at what she saw. She told me it left her in complete shock. I was disgusted. Like, my first initial thought, I was like, that is terrible. I know that would never happen at our school. Wyoming sophomore Lillian Henry was just one of the many in attendance at Jenison High School to watch the Wyoming Wolves take on the Jenison Wildcats. It was a normal Friday night game until something caught Lillian's attention. Well, I first overheard the noises, uh, like monkey noises over the student section, and then my other friend, Lenivia, brought it to my attention that they were, that that was the Jenison student section making those noises, and then that's when we looked over and we had seen them um, like imitating a monkey by like scratching their armpits, pounding on their chest. Lillian saw what many parents and school officials saw much later on social media. In the video, students can be heard making loud and aggressive sounds and gestures imitating monkeys towards a black player on Wyoming. It's something that Lillian says still doesn't sit right with her. Would you call what you saw racist? I would, yes. Because it was only towards two of our um, students of color. Jenison Public Schools has released two statements today on the incident condemning the acts and saying they are now investigating into the matter further, saying, quote, we all need to hold each other accountable and set the standard for how we treat others. Racist behavior in our schools is unacceptable and we will not be silent about it or perpetuate it, close quote. Lillian hopes that more than just an investigation into the incident comes out of this. I know our school is like, nah, we're, we're just very disgusted by this whole situation. And I know my friends and I, we, we would never let that happen at our student section. And it would just never even be a, a thought in our mind. And so I really hope that Jenison as a community, as a school, takes this um, and puts it out there because it's, it's just not right. And I hope things change. And superintendents for both Jenison and Wyoming released statements today saying that they have been in touch with each other to try and find a resolution in all of this. Craig Hoekstra with Wyoming Public Schools called the incident deplorable and unacceptable. JPS says that they have begun an investigation into those students. In the studio tonight, Phil Panarski, News 8.